Jennifer's body. Fuck you, Diablo Cody. Fuck you. I hate you for everything that you stand for. You gave us Juno, and I had to deal with bitches walking around going, Blog you later. Blog you later. Now it's, oh, you're so green jello. Fucking, I, okay. I know you think you're hip. I do. I, I know that you, like, have your little semi-clever ways of saying things, but when I have to sit through your movie and, like, have a fucking, like, dumb bitch to English thesaurus about what the fuck your characters are saying, I really just absolutely fucking... I hate you. Okay. Jennifer's body. Megan Fox. Somebody told the bitch that she, she she could act. And like I think she believed him. And uh she uh plays Jennifer Check, a high school, you know, sex bomb goddess, whatever. And uh she has a friend and her name's Needy something. And uh like Jennifer's the hot one and Needy's the nerdy one and for some reason they pair up Kind of like a Zach Morris and Screech type deal. And, uh, one night they go out and they go see a shittier, shitty version of Good Char- or shittier version of Good Charlotte. And, uh, after the, um, bar catches fire for some stupid reason, um, the band takes Jennifer out in the middle of the forest when, and they believe that she's a virgin to perform a, uh, a satanic ritual honor that would gain their band like, you know, fame and popularity. Apparently, you know, wearing eyeliner and cutting yourself is not enough for this band. You know, they have to go one step beyond. So they sacrifice the bitch, and because Jennifer's not a virgin, Jennifer's kind of a hoe bag, um, she comes back as kind of like a succubus. And she starts offing all these boys that are in high school. And, uh, yeah, there's really not a whole lot to that. Um, she ends up kind of like, wow, I really don't know where to fucking go with this because it's just a stupid fucking movie. Um, she, yeah, she's like, oh, I'm not killing, killing people, I'm killing boys. And, um, you know, they, like, I mean, everything that they spout out in the fucking trailer is, like, like, that's a pivotal moment in the, in the film. It's like, oh, she's not evil, she, or she's not just high school evil, she's real evil, or whatever. Um, it's just, it, it's a very dumb movie, and the only thing good about it was the first, the first poster, the movie poster that they had in the theater, where it had her sitting on the desk with a hand hanging out of it. You know, it was like a throwback to 1980s horror movie posters. And that's not even on the fucking cover of the DVD now. Um, I just really hated this movie. I hate Diablo Cody. I hate Megan Fox. Um, wow. Um, I'm not going to go into the ending with you because I try to remain spoiler free, of course. Um, but it's just... I guess if you're a 15-year-old girl and this is, like, what you're looking for in horror, you know, you'll like it. But if you're a 20, 28, 29-year-old um, horror fan like myself and you're pretty much jaded on anything new, you're going to fucking hate it. And, you won't, and, you might, and it's not even, like, a good hate. Because there, all there is, like, Megan Fox shakes her ass the whole movie. And you don't get to see any boobies. You do get to see her kiss the girl, which they totally, like, it was, that was only thrown, thrown in there for, like, the guys that took their girlfriends who was like, Diablo Cody, woo! You know, they, they threw that in there for the, those guys that had to sit through this piece of shit. They're like, sorry you had to watch our fucked up movie. Here's Megan Fox making, making out with her friend for two or three minutes. <sighs> um, that's really about it. I'm not going to... I, I really just want to be done talking about this movie because I hate it so much. Um, if you disagree with me, comment below. 
Um, rate it even if you hate it. Subscribe if you like it.